Hi, this is Haley Cooper from Bottle Mark Custom Bottle Caps, and today I'm going to show you how to create your very own cap canvas to jumpstart your bottle cap design. I'm going to start with a program called Inkscape. All of my screencasts are going to be about Inkscape. We highly recommend it to our customers. It's free, it's open source, and you can download it on the internet right now. It's a great design program. So they, I first start with a new document. I've got an eight and a half by 11 sheet of paper here, and that's not exactly the canvas that I want. So I'm going to first go to document properties and change the size. I'm going to change the units to inches. Now bottle cap is one inch in diameter. So I'm going to change my initial canvas to one inch by one inch. Good. Now I'm going to zoom in on this so I can work with it a little bit more easily. Next, I'm going to create a cap canvas. We crop all of our images down into a circle, so it's good to make sure that you have a circle so you don't do any design work outside of it. I'm going to try and create a perfect circle. Mm, maybe it's still a little bit oval. That's okay. We can fix it. I'm going to now go up here to the width and the height of the circle I just created. I'm going to change the unit again into inches. Because I'm an American, I like to work with inches. I'm going to make it one by one. Great. Now it's a perfect circle. I'm going to go ahead and lock it down so that the ratio of width to height will stay the same even if I decide to shrink my circle. Now that's not, maybe, maybe it's not exactly center on the page, so I'm going to go up here to align distribute, making sure that I have my circle selected, and I'm going to center it according to the page that I created. So I'm going to go ahead and center it on the vertical axis and then also center it on the horizontal axis. Perfect, fantastic. Um, now I can also change the color of it down here once I have it selected. I can make it blue, I can make it purple, I can make it gray. I can give it a nice little stroke if I hold down shift and click on a different color. Now I have a nice outline around the circle that maybe gives it a little bit of definition. You can always check what colors you have down here. Okay, so we have the beginning of a great cap design. Thanks for watching.